I've been hinting at this master plan that I have for my future on YouTube, and today is the beginning of phase two. And you don't even know what phase one is. Am I gonna explain it? Probably not. But phase two is today, and it's a photo shoot for my Patreon account. Let's do it. I'm trying to decide if I should keep my beard or shave it down a little bit. I wanna have like a boyish innocence, but still like a manly jaw. So I think we're gonna trim. Monopod, the best way to vlog. You just take your camera and you put it on the pod. You make it go higher and you film a lot of shots. You can see the little screen. Wee, 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 wee. Seven millimeters. Ow! <laughs> See, we got that fresh looking fox now. We set that fox out of the hair kennel. It's free. For my next trick, I will select which clothings to wear. Because I'm naked. But I have underwear on. Let's try it. Let's do it. want to be a successful YouTuber, you have to put your clothes on like this. This shirt is on backwards. This YouTube method doesn't always work, okay? It might work for the big guys like Casey Neistat, but not me, okay? We're ready to rock. I probably look like a toddler from this angle. See, I have this uh, C-stand here. Got some sandbags with sand that I got from Home Depot for very cheap. And then I have this like, this the, the Gorilla Pod ball head thing. Gorilla Pod kind of sucks, so I just put the ball head on here using one of these little uh, things that usually hold lights. Then I got this little like quick release plate and it is good to go. All right, my hair's all did up. How does it look? Does it look all right? I like to put it behind my ears because it makes me look kind of like middle-aged and desperate. For a while, I've been wanting to change the branding of my YouTube channel. So that's what we're doing today. We're gonna do a photo shoot so we can brand my YouTube channel and the Patreon. Basically all of my like social outlets like to be consistent. That's the goal for today. The photographer is none other than Lauren Noor. If you remember from one of the previous vlogs, she was trying to decide between getting a Fuji X-T3 and the Sony a7 III. And she went with... The Fuji, the X-T3. It'll be nice to like get some pro photos done and update the channel, make everything look professional. That's my testimony. All the goods are in this backpack, so let's freaking roll. Alexa, turn off all the lights. Okay. Good girl. We're at the location, let's get this big bright white wall that I've shot a few music videos in front of and we're gonna take some pictures I have the camera like this I'm not even gonna explain what I'm doing right now oh yeah the signature eyebrow my mom will love that oh I dig that dude see it's like you're peeking behind something yeah yeah yeah, yeah. I bought the Fuji because if I rented it's gonna be about 200 bucks to rent for just a weekend, and so I decided, F that, if I return and I get all my money back. The Amazon rental program? No. Photo shoot success, bye! Hi! Oops. It's dark. I oh my gosh! I love... Ow, why is it playing? There's something like... <laughs> I think there's a raccoon in here. <laughs> 